hello guys Ronnie here and welcome to your 15th uh, PHP tutorial now, in the previous tutorial we looked at the post uh, function in PHP and in this one we are going to um, it's not actually a function it's a variable the post variable in PHP now and and um, if we can just uh, go back and see what we did in the previous tutorial um, we just created a form here out, outside PHP. It's an HTML form. First name, input. So it's actually an input uh, form where a user can submit their first and second name and click the submit button. And if we preview this in the browser, it's simple as that first name, second name, and submit button. And when the users click the submit button, there's an action here uh, on the form that sends them that sends the data to welcome.php. Now, welcome.php is, is a HTML file that has a welcome and a, some PHP code inside of it. Now, this is echo, which means print out uh, post first name. Now, this code means print out the first name of the user and it, and the first name is reference is a reference to this uh, name here, first name this one here first name so if I change this I will I'll get an error so it's a reference right there now in this tutorial we are going to look at the get now the get is used when you want to get information from uh, um, <clears throat> so the get is actually used when you want to get information using the method get now let's go ahead and look at get I wouldn't edit anything here I just change some stuff I want it I just say get instead of method post I just say change the method to get and I save that file and go to welcome.php and just change this to get alright so change this to get and I'll save it and if we preview it in our browser just refresh this and if I write Ronnie and uh, Kibet and click on submit it still does the same function but the difference here is let me show you right now let me just move my browser a little bit my win window now as you can see local boss it says welcome to php and a question mark and it says first name ronnie second name Quebec. now it, it prints out the first and the last name or the, the data that has been submitted on the u on the on the window uh, on the um uh, browsers on the browser address bar so this is uh, it's not a good way of submitting forms because if you are going to submit passwords and stuff like that, you can make this visible to other other non uh, recommended users. So this can be used uh, when you're creating bookmarks or stuff like that. But we are going to look at that on a later chapter. So that is how the get works. Same functionality, but it displays the. Um, the data on the address bar of the browser okay so um, in the next tutorial we are going to look at um, I don't know what I have in store for you guys but I'll let you know once I, I've set stuff up so thanks for watching this video guys I hope you learned something you learned the difference between um, post and the get and if you have any questions just send me a message and I really appreciate your support guys make sure you keep it up as far as watching this video is concerned and subscribe 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 because i have very cool videos coming along thanks again guys and i'll see you in the next video